Welcome to a bowl of happiness. Today we are making spicy teriyaki chicken don. Spicy teriyaki chicken on rice. This is a perfect dish on a hot day and goes perfectly well with icy cold beer. So be sure to have beer ready in the fridge. Let's get started. You will need two pieces of chicken thigh and some spices like cumin, paprika, chili powder, and grated garlic. Along with olive oil and salt and pepper. First, we apply some invisible cuts into the chicken. This will help the chicken to soak in spices. and sprinkle some salt and pepper on both sides of the meat. And now pour in one tablespoon of olive oil. One teaspoon of cumin. One teaspoon of paprika. One teaspoon of chili powder. And lastly, one teaspoon of grated garlic. Rub in the spices in the chicken, saying you will be super delicious. And let it sit in the fridge for about three hours. Let's start grilling the chicken on skin side down. No oil is required here if you're using the non-stick pan. Use tongs to press down from time to time on the chicken to ensure it cooks through evenly and gets a nice brown crust. Remove the excess oil with paper towel. Once the chicken is brown on the skin side, flip it over. Turn the heat low and cover the chicken with tin foil and steam it till it's fully cooked. And once again, remove the excess oil with paper towel. Be sure to do a good job here as any of the remaining oil debris will cloud the sauce. The whole kitchen is smelling so nice and spicy. 
I can hardly wait to enjoy this dish. And now we pour in the prepared teriyaki sauce. To make this in a small pot, add 5 tablespoons of soy sauce, 3 tablespoons of honey, 3 tablespoons of mirin, and 4 tablespoons of sake. Turn the heat on, and when it's about to start to boil, you turn off the heat and set it aside. And you pour the sauce into the pan. And turn the heat off right away. Cut this delicious looking golden brown chicken into strips. Get your warm rice ready in a bowl and add some shredded dried seaweed on top of it. Then add the chicken on top. It's almost ready. It looks so good. Definitely make sure to drizzle the leftover sauce on top and sprinkle some sesame seeds and green onion on top. And here we are, our spicy teriyaki chicken done is ready. If you like, you can add some Japanese mustard on the side. This dish is so amazing and the flavor of spices just boosts your appetite and also the beer. We make delicious homemade dishes that put a smile on your face. I hope you guys loved today's video and if you did, give it a thumbs up. We introduce more dishes in the future so please come back. Thank you very much for watching and please subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already.